Hello and welcome to Rocket X Exchange. In today's video, we will see how to do a one-click, non-custodial ETH bridge transaction from Arbitrum to Ethereum mainnet and get the best price for the transfer. The best part is that you can do the transaction in a Jiffy without KYC and without an account and still be able to access the liquidity of leading CEXs for this bridge transaction. So let's get started. We start by navigating to app.rocketx.exchange. Please see the description for the link. Let's begin by connecting the wallet. In our example, we are selecting the Arbitrum mainnet and then selecting the MetaMask wallet. Next, select the Arbitrum mainnet and ETH token as the source network and source token. Gas fees will be paid in the native tokens of the source or initiating network, which is ETH in our case. Then, select the Ethereum mainnet and ETH token as the destination network and destination token. Then, adjust the amount of ETH you want to bridge from layer 2, Arbitrum mainnet to layer 1, Ethereum mainnet. Best quotes will be fetched from multiple exchanges like OKX, Rocket XCEX Pool 1, KuCoin, Rango, etc. You can see the corresponding gas fees for each of the exchanges along with the minimum received destination token. You can override the selection done by RocketX when you have quotes from more than one exchange by clicking over your preferred exchange. You could avail platform fees discount of up to 100% by holding RVF, the exchange's native token. Let's switch back to the exchange prompted by RocketX as the best option. Now, click on the bridge button to complete the swap. Agree to the terms and conditions to proceed. Approve the transfer to RocketX router and also make a note of the address to match it in the MetaMask pop-up. Next, you need to confirm transaction to proceed in the MetaMask pop-up. The pop-up will display estimated gas fees in ETH. Note that the router address is the same as in the previous step. Once you are happy, click on the confirm button. Next, the transaction confirmation screen pops up, displaying the transaction status as submitted, processed, and finally, success. If you face any issues, you can raise a ticket via the help menu. In the history section, you will be able to see the transaction status and details and the final transaction hash will take you to the Etherscan Explorer. Hope you found this video useful. If you have further questions or feedback, consider joining our Telegram channel. Links are in the description. Thanks for watching.